glory to God. It's a beautiful Wednesday morning and we're so excited with what God is doing. Lord Jesus, we worship you. We thank you for your goodness, your mercy, your love, your protection of our lives. It's a beautiful day again in your presence and we're so happy. We want to listen to your word to transform our hearts. Bless us mightily in the name of Jesus. Amen. Super excited to share with us a powerful scripture in the book of John chapter 9 from verse 5. Just verse 5, he says, As long as I'm in the world, I am the light of the world. This is Jesus speaking because before he performed the miracle downwards there in that same John, where a young man that was brought blind came to him and he instructed that the young man should go and wash his face in the pool of Siloam. And the young man was totally healed and delivered totally healed and delivered when they brought this young man to jesus they were asking jesus is it that this man have seen or his parents have seen that he was born blind because he was actually born blind but it was just a simple word jesus gave them he said i am in this world because i'm the light of the world jesus told them in verse 4 that's in john chapter 9 he said i must walk the works of him that sent me while it is day for the night cometh when no man can walk the young man received his sight he was totally healed and delivered this brings us to the point we want to talk about today if we have jesus as the light of the world we never need to be worried of any situation or any challenge because the light of the world he knows the end from the beginning he knows the end from the beginning when they brought the young man that was blind before jesus all he did was to spit on the ground and he used the, the, the spit to form up a clay and he rubbed on the young man's eye and told the man to go and wash in the pool of Siloam and the man went and washed and he was totally free listen to me Jesus is a miracle worker he brought a lot of mystery brought a lot of revelation brought a lot of reality of the God even upon us as humanity and remember one of the utmost things Jesus did was to lay down his life as a sacrifice for us so therefore you must embrace this love of jesus acknowledge the love of jesus and allow him to rule over your life let him be a light to your world remember this world is full of darkness every day so we need a light to be able to penetrate we need light to be able to see through we need light to be able to get the visibility we need and all this comes from jesus please do not seek for fame do not seek for riches do not seek for all these vain things from demonic sources remember jesus is the only way and as we go to him seek his face on a daily basis even by studying his word and having that communion and fellowship with him our lives can never remain the same god bless you i'm also celebrating you because we are launching into a new month tomorrow have a blessed day. God bless you. See you tomorrow. Bye.